All right, so your boy in the spirit of continuing a series that needs to be continued. I got videos that uh, ain't even posted. Um, but we're going to skip over the Yu-Gi-Oh! videos for the time being and get to Pokemon. Uh, my, Poke my PlayStation 4 right now is launched like a fighter jet in the background, so I'm sure it's going to come over. But uh, I'm going to go ahead and try to get some of these done. I got my mic, but for some reason I'm not using it. So it's going to be back to the shitty December uh, quality on the audio. But this is from heaven. Pokemon grading cards. I have probably about... 200 to 300 from back when I uh, was a jit, a young lad. Uh, so we're going to grade these. See if there's anything here worthwhile. And I mean, god damn if I don't need a new camera. Because holy shit, this is, this is untenable. Can you even see these? Can you make these? Uh, <laughs> can, you, can you do anything with this? Do I, can you do anything with this? You know, anyway, man, let's go. Let's go ahead and get to the, uh, the shmeet of the action. This is for heaven. Uh... Alright, all right. so what we got here is about, I have multiple packs, about 15 cards, sorted all by alphabetical order. So I'm going to go through about, I don't know, 30 to 45, seeing how, this, seeing as how my, you know, how my speed goes. And um, we'll see if any of these are worth anything, uh, and they're not, then fuck me. Um, yeah, so point forty, pretty cool. Not worth their name whatsoever. Alakazam. Uh, old classic Alakazam. I thought I was like Alakazam was like one of the most badass uh, cards when I was young, just because he would just come in like not say shit. 120, pretty decent. Uh, number two. Let's see if we get anything. Oh. Well. Uh, let's try that. All right, number two. 25. I mean, he's number two, so he should be kind of relevant, I would think. $8.51. Okay. Um, hologram rare. See, this Alakazam, I should be showing it to you guys. For the sake. This is Alakazam, he's shiny. He's got a little bit of shine there, so I assume he is. Yeah, that he's not that. He's, he's this one, the hologram rare. So he's a hologram rare, $8.51. I already going better than my Yu-Gi-Oh videos typically would. Alamolia, I don't think she's in anyone, any, um, Al, Al, Alamolia, Alamolia, Alamo, the, the Grand Ole Opry. Um, Alamolia, who is a promo card and five out of 12, uh, $1.62, McDonald's promo cards. By the way, uh, this is February 8th I'm recording this on. It's supposed to be McDonald's promo cards coming in tomorrow. You already know your boys have to come down, uh, stop by and get some of those. Uh, if you're not doing it and you have been in the game, McDonald's promo cards are just like legit pretty cool. They're always cool with the randomization that you have with those. I think you're supposed to have a ton of hologram rares. I don't know if they've had them in like the past, um, few years. So, like, I've, I've, I don't eat at McDonald's much and, uh, I think it's in part because of the increasing like hype over Pokemon cards why he brought them back. Uh, mine is, my Altaria is quite uh, scratched up, but 0.45. I have quite a few scratched up cards. I didn't actually use uh, sleeves on Pokemon cards for some reason. I had them, I just didn't use them. So Arbok, um, and because of the thickness of Pokemon cards, I usually put like 20 to 25. Yeah, I made 25 work. 25 Yu-Gi-Oh cards go in the pack. But because of the uh, thickness, Pokemon cards in comparison, I can only put like 15 in comfortably. Uh, 52 cents for this Arbok. Uh, let's move to Aaron. I wish it was a faster way to kind of flip through these. Uh, I don't have any packs pulled up, and I don't, I just got, I don't know if they have packs. Um, but they do have packs. I can see this like some serious treasures, plasma gla uh, blast, crystal guardians. I know they have packs, but like the uh, codes that you look at for this doesn't match up to packs, so you can't just say. Uh, B L A R O O dash O N fifty one, and be like, okay, well, now I pulled up every single one out of certain. You know, let's say you had a lot of the same pack. Boom, you could just do that. But with this, uh, at least for my card, it seems to be quite more random. Uh, Aaron fifty seven out of one hundred eleven, only eighteen cents. 
This um was one of my crown jewels. I think the last one I followed heavily heavily um out of Pokemon was the Diamond and Pearl, da Dialga and Palkia, also featuring Dark Ride Arceus. Um I loved Arceus, I love Dark Ride. Uh fuck the order up. There's another errand I have to do, but we'll get back to them in a second. Matter of fact, let's go ahead and get Aaron done. So it's not already here. Uh, this is 48 out of 92, uh, Aaron. 49 cents. So Arceus, let's, <laughs> let's get, the, get the blue balls off and see what Arceus is worth. Now, I know just because a card is, like, very rare, in terms of, like, Pokemon lore doesn't mean it's going to be a very rare card. And, in fact, none of these appear to be incredibly rare. But, oh, shit. Wait, no, that's not mine. That's not my ultra rare. All right, let's see what mine is worth. So this is DP53. He does not have a number, which is interesting. $20.64? Holy shit on my fucking dick. Wow. Hologram Rare Dialga and Palkia. Oh, Diamond and Pearl promos. Let's see what, what what's the money in that, uh, in that setup. Uh... Okay. I want to see the pack. Diamond. I wonder if he's high ball, high money. I imagine he'd be higher than Di uh, Dialga and Pokey or anything. I don't know. He could be. It's a lot of hologram rares here. I don't know. What's high money? Why Charizard is so like over, like like crazily priced in in uh in po like every, all the big money cards are Charizard for some reason? Is it because like? Memory wise, Char people love Charizards. I didn't even have the highest uh, Arceus in that pack. That's the craziest shit. Do I have that? I may have that. I'm gonna have that Pikachu. I may, but that's gonna be like way like videos way down the line. Let me see, make sure I'm still recording. Yeah, uh, Pikachu is gonna be way down the line, especially at the rate that I'm grading uh, these right now. I wish I could talk. It'd be cool. Uh, at Sue. Another McDonald's promo card. I'm gonna bring him with me. Uh, 2012. Wow, there he is right there. Uh, 703. I'm gonna bring him with me to the uh, to the McDonald's. We go look. Because apparently he was a pretty valuable card. I think you know the funniest thing is that people used to like basically like give you those cards back in the day, and like someone could have gave you like a a hundred dollar card, a two hundred dollar card, three hundred dollar card, and never even knew it. Uh, bagging, big on, big on, um, pretty useless, only 27 cents, and I actually have one of these, uh, Latios and L Latios, Latios and Latios, from 2004, holy fuck, uh, I've been in this game for a while, boy, this, this is 49, this is 1 out of 10, yeah, so this is, this is 23 cents, then I have another box, I'm gonna find every kind of pronunciation possible. Lifting this card hurts. 
15 cents. So first, uh, 15 pack, I believe we had, what, $20 artist? So that's pretty fucking cool. Um, on to our next pack. I think it's the Beast. I don't know what it is in that one. Bellosum. 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 Definitely not a hologram or anything crazy like that. Uh, 15. 1 out of 12. I think that's mine right there. 19. Yeah. So 1 out of, one, one, one out of 12. 1 dollar and 12 cents. Good opener. I don't think I have it. I definitely have seen that before though. Uh, 85 Bell Sprout. Where are we at? Where are we at? Hello? Oh, yeah, 48 cents. 49, yeah. So, kind of like faint, um, I hate, I guess that's faint, um, like little, little, you know, styles out there. A little, little, little flair there. A little Ric Flair. Ooh, shit out there. I'm like, didn't have this foil there, but this little little flare, that shit ain't gonna be working. They have different cards for the same fucking look. That's just that's just poor. Like that's just poor um design. They have two commons, but they have the same number. Uh two different commons have the same number. That's just stupid. Alright, bronze it. You can see the card better. You don't need to see me. You can see the card better. Bronze or um 74 out of 123, 34 cents. Bulbasaur, not a very rare one, but he sees one. Bulbasaur. If I'm enjoying the video to this point, which I'm sure you're probably not, because how many times I've stumbled, stumbled over my own words, like I did right there, um, you know, drop a like. I'll probably be opening packs, more packs before long. I think the video, the last video I uploaded was me uploading Pokemon packs, so I'm glad that got out there. A dollar and three. sells Pokemon cards and shit. Um, they said they had multiple uh, hologram rare Charmanders. <laughs> they said they had a fucking safe. <laughs> I asked them, like, yeah, we got them in a safe. Uh, you can't show them. <laughs> you, you, you can't see them. You, that's you can't see them. <laughs> I was like, yo, okay, cool. 51 cents for this one. Definitely not uh, worth millions. Let's actually just look at this for high to low. I think Charmander and Charmander both have pretty good value. So there's no, there's not any secret rare hologram, or not any hologram rare Charmander. So Charizard, the, the Japanese version of this, the English version of this, the version of this without a shadow, a shining Charizard. I got the same card, like four variations. All, all of the versions of that card. Oh, this is just Charizard. This is just Charizard. My bad. I was about to say, there's no way. Of, like my fuck, twenty thousand dollars. Holy fuck! It's like a fucking. That's not a top order. It's like a shitty ass like black squeeze. There's a guy who's a ten thousand dollars to win a shitty ass black squeeze. I can't really talk to anybody. But that's not a top order. I have top order. Don't judge me. Why is this so cheap? This is a very 
your valuable coin? Why is so cheap? I can kind of see the top three. It, I don't even have these cards. I'm looking at Charizard. We're supposed to be talking about what I have. And I have a Charmander and a Charmillion. I don't have a damn Charizard. Oh, I was going to have Charizard. 59. Uh, 99. So my fucking is just bad. It's just bad, bad, bad. It's not any good. Because it's so victim. I'm just bad, bad, bad. I was a peak of this mess for a little bit. And went down here from there. So I charged $35.99. Uh, let's see. promo cards. I did. I didn't know I did the Burger King promo cards too. Holy shit. I didn't know that. I think what I would do and, and this is back when like places like fucking advertise their fucking um their their um their promos like their toy promos. I think anytime I saw a Pokemon or Yu-Gi-Oh promo for a place I would just go eat there. Like, it didn't matter what the I hate Burger King. I hated Burger King. I still hate it to this day. But, like, if they had some good shit, bro, I was... If they didn't have good shit, I was going to eat there just to have a fucking chance to pull something. I usually got garbage, but, uh... Yeah, I think we're going to end it there. Uh, I don't want to ruin the surprise. I had fun. I don't know if y'all had fun, but I, I had fun. Um, we're going to come back with some more. I think that's some pretty decent cards. Uh, I have a Lucari I'm looking at right now. It's probably pretty, pretty solid. But I'm gonna save that. Hope you all enjoy. Um, go get the McDonald's promos cards, bro. Go get the McDonald's promo cards. Everybody needs them in their life. Oh, here, here's my yeah. So here's my deck. Um, not my deck, but my other additional cards. So I still have to sort out quite a bit. Maybe I'll find a Char's heart <laughs> somewhere in all this, but uh. I uh, I doubt it. Based on what I'm looking at right here, I don't think that will be in my possession anytime soon. Yeah, I don't see a Charizard. So nothing that hype is coming in this video, but I'll let y'all know if I find something.